If you're new to photography and you've wondered how focal length affects your photograph, this video might be just for you. Welcome to the Naked Photographer, where I'll be exposing myself. No, 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 I won't. Mm -hmm. That's not better in my head. This video is going to show the difference between a portrait, in this case, a half length portrait with a variety of different focal lengths to demonstrate how a wide angle focal length can distort your subject versus a long focal length, but also the distance at which the camera must be from your subject to render that size of a portrait. So you can see as the focal length is getting longer, I am moving bit by bit further from the camera to maintain the same perspective of portrait. And now I'm going to demonstrate how the lenses change the apparent distance of your subject from the camera. So I am staying in the same position and I am now working downward back to the beginning of each focal length. But by staying stationary, you can see how my appearance seems to get further and further from the camera. And there you can see how focal length affects your subject, both in the distortion of a portrait close up and how close you must be on short focal lengths, or the distance that you need to be on long focal lengths, but it's a more natural look for a portrait. Vice versa, when you're looking at your subject through a short focal length, how close they appear to the camera when they aren't, and when you go to a wide angle, how far away your subject can appear. So hopefully that will help you choose the right focal length for the photograph you want to make. And please like, comment, and subscribe on these videos so I can make more of them.